hi welcome to data on my view in this video i'm going to show how to get a subtotal for uh, a group of uh, fields in a particular column or a set of columns so here i have a report so in this report um, i have a store name category name category name lines quantity sold and sales revenue so i have explained the web aggregate web aggregate functions uh, which you can get it through here under functions tab i have explained each one of the tab which you can easily use to see how many uh, line items are there or uh, what is the total sales revenue what is the percentage so you can use these functions to get those informations now we are going to get uh, subtotal uh, for store name or um, instead of store name we'll take uh, city for better understanding so we have california so we have only one state let me see whether we have any filtered there is no filter okay here we have a filter remove remove so now we have uh, different uh, state names so now what we have to do is we have to create a break for state column so break in the sense it is going to uh, break after each unique value the first value is california and if you see uh, colorado is a second value so we are going to break so subtotal is going to be like uh, subtotal for california and subtotal for uh, rest of the state values so which we can't achieve through these existing functions if you go here and if you can enable the sum function for overall uh, num overall uh, records but here we are going to have a subtotal for a group of values under state okay so to get that uh, right click on the state column go to break so here we are using a break option select break and add break so it is going to split your uh, table into a uh, multiple section of table based on the state value so this is one set of table i mean a first table uh, which has a header uh, and again we have a second table which has header again but uh, in our case we don't want this header because as we have a header uh, in the top of this table itself that will be sufficient so we can remove this and we have on empty uh, line so here we need to get uh, total so this is going to be subtotal right so i'll take a sales revenue here so this is going to be sum of uh, sales revenue for california again uh, for colorado uh, we can check the value so like this we we got the result but uh, still the formatting issue uh, is an issue right so we have to fix that formatting right click on the table go to break and go to manage break here this is our break when i select uh, these are the properties are already enabled i don't want to break my header so because of that we can see uh, multiple times of header so i don't want to get that i i should have only one header so i'll select this option as uncheck and uh, duplicate value i just want to merge because here you can see everything is null 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 at last we have a california so i want to merge everything as a single set so once i merged and click ok here you can see everything is considered as a single cell and this is our subtotal so we can remove this empty column uh, empty row as well delete remove row so now we got uh, as we expected california and subtotal of california but here we don't have a header as we uncheck the header we have to enable in this format table section so click show table header so now we got a header 
and this is uh, first uh, section california and subtotal of california and next value and subtotal uh, third value then uh, it is going to be on a third page subtotal so it is going to be like uh, subtotal for each unique value under state column so this is how we have to achieve the subtotal we know uh, that the grand total is going to be uh, uh, available based on these functions some functions all right thank you